How's it going YouTube? I'm just gonna do a little comparison of two rear uh, backup iron sights. On the left here we have the Troy Industries folding battle sight. On the right you have the MA Tech uh, battle sight. So I'm just gonna show you them up close. These are both in the folded position. To flip up the mat, the MA Tech, you just push it, and it pops up. You have a single aperture, which is fairly small, and you are adjustable for elevation on the side here. But the standard setting being this line. You also have adjustments for windage here on the right. This sight sits nice and low on the rifle. To attach it, you have you just have a simple hex bolt here that you just tighten down on your Picatinny rail. The Troy Industries folding battle sight. You um to flip it up you just push it up and it locks into place. The most notable thing about the Troy Industries sight is that it has the dual aperture like most standard AR sights. Which personally I like because you have a wide sight for just you know, fast acquisition, close combat, and then you have the smaller peephole here for longer distance shots. It is not adjustable for elevation, however it is adjustable for windage over here. To close this one, you push in on this button. While simultaneously folding down and it locks into place. The MA Tech also folds down, you just fold it till it clicks. It's a little harder to get up, you just kind of have to push it up with your thumb. They both sit fairly low. The Troy, I would say, fits a little bit lower, mainly because it doesn't have the large adjustment piece for the elevation on the side here. Personally, I prefer the, tr prefer the Troy sights just because I like having the uh, larger sight for fast target acquisition. But they're both great sights. They're both full all metal and very sturdy. Alright, if you have any questions, please leave me a comment or a message. Thanks for watching.